Good morning, my name is Ezra. And, and welcome to AM Central. Hi, my name is Ira Capel. Hi, I'm Trey Kavan. And, and this, this is how to be a student athlete. athlete. And today we'll be going over how to balance all school, sports, and personal life. The first step to being a good student athlete is being a good student. There will be times where you get home late, but that homework has to get done. Because when it doesn't, you start falling behind and those grades start to slip. A good student athlete stays after school a couple of times a week just to stay on top of their work. When you're a student athlete, most of the time your social life is going to come last behind your schoolwork, sports, and at-home responsibilities. Sometimes you can squeeze in your social life a little bit more often, but if you do it too much, it might affect your main priorities you have going on right now in your life, which could end up for you falling behind your senior classage which could affect your sports life. When you're playing sports, it's most important to stay hydrated. You have to drink a lot of water. Try to stay away from caffeine, as in coffee and sodas and a lot of juice, because if you don't drink a lot of water, you can end up being dehydrated on the field or the court or whatever you're doing as a sport, and that can lead you to potentially passing out from a heat stroke or just get be dehydrated in general. Uh, another important thing to do when you're a student athlete is stay in shape. Uh, make sure you focus on your arms, core, and legs. You know, never skip leg day. Um, in the off season of whatever your sport is, make sure you're involved in something else. Um, you know, running, and I know for football, the weight room is important, so lift weights and run. And, and thanks for watching on How to Be a Student Athlete. Hi, my name is Jocelyn. Welcome back to Movie Reviews. Today we'll be talking about the movie Black Panther that everyone has been talking about. It's a wonderful movie, so let's get to it. King T'Challa returns to his home, Wakanda. He is put to a test of both of the kings of his country, Black Panther, and he is drawn into a conflict that puts the fate of Wakanda and the world at risk to defeat his enemies and protect his country. The king must rally his allies and unleash the power of Black Panther. Now, here's a sneak peek of Black Panther. Black Panther. Must feel good. Sitting here comfortable. What do you want? Your secrets. Your weapons. I'ma burn it all. This ends today. Who need a hero? Panther. You need a hero. Me personally, I really like this movie because the theme of the conflict is presented well. The costumes was amazing. There was good fights, a lot of action going on. Everything just fell into a good place. I'm always ready for a war again. Go down that road again. It's all the same. I'm always ready to take a life again. about the word of the day. The word of the day is pathological and the meaning of pathological means a liar. My dad introduced me to machining so that kind of got me introduced to the mechanical industry so then I pursued that interest here at STIC. I started the Mechanical Engineering Technology Program 
and just from the start I loved it because I was working with real parts, um, nice machinery, and the field is just ever growing. So I just love being a part of something that is so technology based and that is what I'm just really interested in. No! Believe in yourself with a little faith in your abilities. Without a humble but responsible confidence in your own powers, you cannot be successful or happy. That's all for Not Central. And have a great vacation.